all started around like November in 2016. Um, one of my, I don't know, I guess you could call him a role model. He was uh, good friends with my brother, and I guess you could call him a buddy, but I don't know, he's somebody I look up to. He was a really good role model and uh, taught me a few good lessons. Um, and when I heard out the news that uh, he uh, died by suicide, I was heartbroken because I was somebody I looked up to. And, uh, somebody I would text every here and then. But uh, knowing that he took his own life and you know, all that, it hurt me a lot. And around that time, I was getting more and more depressed because of that and because of other reasons, school and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, so I didn't really open up to anybody. I uh, really didn't say anything. People would ask me, I would just be like, oh, it doesn't really matter. It wasn't that big of an issue, but it really was. And in uh, April of 2017, one of my better buddies, <laughs> uh, Elijah, he, uh, he was down in the dumps like I was, super depressed, and he took his own life also. And that's when it really hit me, because he was close. I really cared for him. Didn't really show it. And I regret not doing that, but it really killed him inside like it was killing me. But I knew I couldn't take my own life. It was just, you know, it's a temporary problem to a permanent solution. And I just couldn't do it. I couldn't do it to my family and all that. And uh, around then, also, his brother, Noah, uh, died in an ATV accident and all of this stuff was just piling on me. Had a breakup and it was just killing me on the inside and I didn't really open up to anybody because uh, I didn't feel the need to. Um, and then it got real bad and I tried opening up but I didn't know how to. So I just still kept it bottled inside. Eventually, my dad ended up taking me to Mine Springs. Um, went to the West Spring, or yeah, West Springs, part of the hospital, and learned new coping skills. Learned how to deal with my problems, and it really helped me out. After that, you know, other stuff, you know, did, did bring you down, but overall, became a better person, became happier, became more filled with life. I don't want anybody, well, it's gonna happen, but I don't want anybody to feel how I felt, knowing that they can't open up or that they don't want to open up. I'm here to like help them to open up or talk about whatever's going on on their mind because I need somebody like that for me and Elijah and Junior needs somebody like that, but they didn't have it and I would like to be that for somebody.